I'll give you a little overview. <laughs> Just a little sneak peek. So this is the setup right now we've got going on. This armchair that I got at the thrift store for $40. And it's so comfortable, guys. So I locked this when I was moving it, and then I totally forgot where I put the key. So desk, chair, mirror. I think this closet is so cool. And then it has some drawers at the bottom too, so. Just keep everything all tucked away in there. And then I also have those star of the show, the mantle, and then this dress up. Now that you're more comfortable with the space, let's get into getting ready. So I took a shower last night and washed my hair because it was gross. And now I need to do something with it. I think we're gonna wave it or this. Also, my sister Allison goes to school with me now, which is so fun. I'm gonna go ahead and wave my hair. It's still a little dampity damp, so I might go blow dry it a little bit before. So this is the outfit that I was thinking. It's just a crop top from Ari and these jeans that I thrifted at the thrift store yesterday. But I also have an option of some cargo shorts that I think would be really cute. These jeans are really comfortable and stretchy, but they are technically like two sizes too big for me. So I, I don't know. Very short. I think I might go with these. With my white Converse. Here's the deal. I'm gonna do a Becoming episode about fashion and like finding your style because I have a hard time with clothes. Ooh, maybe I can wear this belt to tie in the white shoe. In case you guys have not seen any of my previous college vlogs or like know what school I go to, I go to Southern Virginia University. It's fabulous. It's a really, really small school. Maybe not two reallys. It's a really small school in Virginia, and this is technically my third year here, but I did summer semesters and everything, so I am graduating this year, which is crazy. So I'm packing up my backpack right now. I'm gonna ride my bike to school today, which I think is so funny. Oh yeah, one thing about SVU is that every student gets an iPad. I don't have any like large books or anything that I have to carry around. I always just get the PDF version or like an online version. Gum always. An empty laxative bag. I actually just had surgery a couple weeks ago, which I haven't told you guys yet, but I'll fill everybody in on like what it was about and everything in a bit once I'm like fully healed. So I just don't want to talk about it right now. <laughs> so we'll talk about it later. I have some snacks in the fridge downstairs. So I'm gonna grab those and then we're going to school. The bike. I don't know if I dare to ride it and film at the same time. So I'll see you at school. Now headed to the wire. See you up there. Good. Hi. How are you? I'm good. Do you want to be in one of my videos? Sure. <laughs> okay, you just say hi. <laughs> we just took first day of school pictures to send to. Can you just stop on? Yes. <laughs> we just took first day of school pictures to send to our parents and to post on Instagram. Allison is here. Allison's been having issues with the Wi-Fi, so we're headed to IT. Is that Isaac? Isaac! He can't hear me. We might go say hi to Isaac. We just ate at the calf. The you new- the Okay, I just ate at the calf. Allison just sat there and hung out with me. 
They redesigned the whole new thing. Wait, what? <laughs> redesigned the whole new thing? <laughs> they redesigned the whole calf, so it looks really good now. And I don't know, the food was good. Thank you, Allison. I appreciate it. About to ride my bike. <laughs> I think it's so funny. Welcome, Knights. Dun, dun, dun. Thank you. All right. Love you, Ali Pie. See you later. My bike's still there. I don't have a lock for it. I'm banking on the goodwill of the students here. So if anyone steals it, that's sad. So I just finished my first day of school. I biked my way home. It's crazy how much faster it is to ride a bike home. And it's also crazy just how much of a workout it is on your legs when you ride a bike. Yeah, I haven't ridden a bike consistently in a long time. So it's a good workout. Anyway, I just finished my last first day ever of school. And I feel like I'm going to be a student for my whole life. So it's just weird. I'll give you guys a recap of the day and... A rundown on what the semester looks like for me what classes I'm taking and I'll show you a little bit of my schedule today I had four classes entrepreneurship graphic design typography and Bella Voce which is choir graphic design and typography are in the same computer lab with the same professor so that's kind of convenient that I'm just there but then I just have this like random hour-ish of time. I just kind of brought a few snacks that I ate like before graphic design. And then I didn't have anything to eat until after Bella Voce. So I need to figure out like when I'm gonna eat and like if I'm gonna bring it and like all that stuff. I've, I've gotta make a routine out of that because I need to bring food if I'm doing choir that late. And then on Tuesdays and Thursdays, I'm taking Institute, which is a religion course and then a little bit of time. And then I have strategic management. Really the beginning of the year, I just try to like figure out a routine I want to work out at some point in between these classes so figuring that out would be nice whenever they get a gym schedule because then I'll be able to know if I want to work out before I even start classes or if I'm going to want to do it like in between them. Overall today was great. I actually in my entrepreneurship class I thought a different teacher was teaching it so that was kind of interesting going in and I'm like oh I didn't know there's a different teacher. But he seems like a cool guy, so hopefully it is a good class. It might be a little bit harder because it's actually his first time teaching here. He's been at school for a long time, got his PhD and stuff, so this is like, he's new, you know? Usually it's a little rocky start, so I'm praying for the best. Overall, it was a good day. I'm just going to edit this video because it's going up on Friday. Isn't this room so cute? I can't get over it. I can't wait till it's like so cute, you know, decorated and everything. It feels good to be back, guys. I hope you feel it. I hope you are excited. Please, please leave suggestions. I love doing vlogs, but I would love to combine it with something a little more meaningful. Because I don't want all my videos to be like the Becoming series. Like that's those t took me so many hours to do and wouldn't be able to put one up every week. So if I want to be consistent on here, then it needs to be something that's a little more lifestyle, just filming what I'm doing. Whether it be like teaching you guys something or just sharing a message with you, I want there to be something there. I can kind of weave it into these vlogs so they're a little bit more impactful. So if you have video ideas, please let me know because I'm not really in tune with what you guys want to see other than vlogs. That's my plan. Still figuring it out. Thank you for sticking with me as I do that. If you haven't followed me on Instagram, I'm trying to be more up to base on that. And I just took these pictures that are so cute. They won't be going up for a while because it's part of a brand deal. Oh my gosh. You should go follow me so you can see them. I was just amazed and I took them by myself. So anyways, love you guys so much and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys. When you were younger, you didn't see things quite the same as you do now. But now you're older, you find that sometimes you wish you had stayed a clown.